Relax, you're a ringer. I mean, what'd you get on your SATs? A Nobel Prize nomination. Okay, I believe there's a rational explanation for everything. Then explain me. Can someone please explain why I'm having a conversation with puppets? Well, Daphne saw this create your own puppet store and decided a fun way to learn about yourself is to see yourself in puppet form. Then you started talking to the puppets. I can't help you with the rational part. Look, my puppet of me's puppet of me has a puppet of me and so on. Oh, on. oh look at you all alone. You want to be best pals? A girl and her bunny. Oh, we are so alike. We're both a little squirmy, and one of our feet is good luck. We are peas in a pod, little one. Relax. The odds of all of us being attacked and or further educated are negligible. At least one of us will likely survive to solve the mystery. Only I shall live! <laughs> nope. But what about... No, trust me. Why do you have a beard? I think a better question is, why don't you have a beard? Here we go. Because I don't want one? Well, I do. I don't hear you questioning Shaggy about his beard. Did you hear that, Chin Fuzz? You've officially been recognized as a beard. Oh, we're so proud. Shaggy's a man. Another first. <laughs> Take that, Uncle Dave. We're so proud. Does anyone else see a pig? I know. Look at him. A little stray baby pig. Technically, I don't think there are any stray animals on a farm, Daphne. This pig, this bunny, and I are like a family that's trying desperately to get away from each other at any cost. Like a family. We're the new Shaggy and Scooby. Daphne and Duffy and Dinky. We have so much in common. Nostrils, for one. Oh, and we birth our young live in amniotic sacs. Come on, you two. Focus. And gross. Look, I told Beth how good we were at solving mysteries, and sneezing and dripping and hoarding livestock isn't helping. <gasps> Bless you. Daphne, try to tie the rope to something! exudes the pranic energy and dark whispers of the other kin who seek its shelter. Right. Well, it's your lucky day, Mr. Bayou. We'll solve this mystery of the swamp monster for you. I'm not sure what point you're trying to make. If you're gonna be uphill on Halloween, then I'm gonna have fun for you by dressing as you on Halloween if you decided to have fun by dressing as a zombie. Like I actually followed that. The logic is impeccable. Wow, that's so cool, Velma. They love you here. You're big in Japan. Uh, Daphne, why are you wearing your jacket backwards? My front was cold and my back was hot. I call it the jack words. Velma! Aki! Ah, science lab partners is a bond neither time nor distance can sever. Aki, these are my friends. Sugoi, so cool. You have such a great style. Oh, thank you. Huh? Jack words? Don't get too excited, Daphne. I think she's just being polite. Jack words. Please. The ancients never spoke of such a creature. It's as if the shadow itself has inhabited the swamp. It's living purpose only to kill. <laughs> oh, man, I am freaking out. And wow, are you not helping? Sorry, that was a totally accidental summoning. It is an honor to finally meet you, Velma-sama. 
I designed this line of kimono especially after you. It would be my pleasure if you would accept it as a gift. Thank you, Mr. Kagawa. It'll be perfect for tonight's festival. Huh, I don't think I did this right. Yeah, you didn't. So cool! Huh? Sonoi ne! I guess I daphneized it. Hmm. Look into my eyes, mortal. Tell us about this foul swamp creature. <laughs> I like her! She's loonier than me! So, not Boomery? If there's a phantom on the loose, we should split up and look for clues. Ooh! First, let's play a slumber party game to get us in the mystery-solving mood. How about charades? Daphne, you're not... Two words! Movie title. Waving flashlight. Lighthouse? Waving. Girl with a lampshade on her head? Breathing lampshade. Heavy breathing. Lighthouse. A weird hand gesture. <laughs> Meaning throat point. <laughs> Skiing hamster 2, the sequel. Fighter pilot. Lighthouse. Um. <sighs> Never mind. What do you think it wants? According to the legend, it's searching for the golden scroll. Let's spread out. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's happening? Yeah, isn't that my... me? You've got to be kidding. Daphne! Aki, hey, what's going on? Daphne's picture has been downloaded two million times already. It's gone viral. Cool. Does that mean I'm big in Japan? Wow, Daphne, I guess you're the new thing. I know. Isn't it great? Yeah. Great. Looks good to me. <laughs> the beard is spoken. I'm back, Hollywood. Well, Daph, I guess you win. The beard helped. No, Fred, you were right. The beard's too much. Thank you. I'm glad you finally came to your senses. I think I'm just going to rock the mustache. I'll be in the van. Don't worry, Duffy and Dinky. I'll protect you from the danger. I'm putting you in. Oh! I will call you Dippy. And just like me, you're now in mortal danger! No, too easy. How about... Daphne, house, now! <laughs> All right, Velma, fine. I can read between the sneezes. You're right. I have too many animals, and we have nothing in common. I just wanted a close relationship with an animal, like Shaggy and Scooby. Like you can't force that kind of bond. It takes years of love, terror, and unending hunger to have what Scooby and I have, which is love, terror, and hunger. Uh, not necessarily in that order. I guess we've all been distracted today. Velma, you won't admit your allergies are causing you problems. Who's talking? Is someone there? And Shaggy and Scooby. Well, you're always distracted from the mystery, so you're cool. And? I'm sorry. Without my sister, I can't finish a... Uh? Coffee table book about the Australian Outback? Guys, the Phantom must have grabbed Trudy. What am I gonna do? I can't function without my... Bath salts. Bath salts? <laughs> wow, Fred, that's worse than my coffee table book guess. No, 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 look, bath salts. All over the floor leading down the hall. Perhaps to a coffee table book about Australia. <gasps> it's all coming together. You're gaining on him. Why, great, let's get closer to the angry flying dinosaur. Good plan, Fred. Don't worry, I'm... Daphne, what are you doing? This might be my last chance to celebrate my birthday. There, a birthday party needs a clown. I'm honored. He's too fast. I got an idea. The birthday girl's weapon of choice. It's working! 
Brett, the presents! Here, use the sacks! Yay! Time for cake! Uh-oh. Guys, we're... Huh? Oh, 